Hey guys, what's up? Today we've got something exciting to discuss and it's about the revamped Aurora on Advanced Server. We'll be diving deep into the pros and cons of this much-anticipated update. First up, let's talk about the pros of the revamped Aurora. Short cooldown on skill 1. Aurora's first skill now has a significantly reduced cooldown. With a 40% cooldown reduction build, you can spam it almost non-stop, making her a formidable presence in team fights and skirmishes. Here are some samples using these items. As you can see, you can cast the skill again right after it's done. Do one combo for instant freeze. The basic combo of using her second skill followed by her first skill results in an instant freeze on the enemy. This combo is perfect for catching opponents off guard and setting up ganks. All you need to do is cast your second skill followed by a quick first skill. The enemies will typically receive 2 or 3 hailstones before they can move. Outplay Potential with Passive Aurora's passive skill, Pride of Ice, gives her a lot of outplay potential. If she takes fatal damage, she will be encased in ice and become invulnerable for a short period of time. It's similar to Nana's passive, but the enemy doesn't know if it's available or not, adding an element of surprise to her gameplay and allowing for clutch escapes. This can be used to escape from dangerous situations or to turn the tide of a battle. Double Freeze Combo with Ultimate Combining her second skill with her ultimate creates a double freeze effect. This is perfect for team fights as it can disrupt the enemy's team positioning and give your team a significant advantage. That's 1 second on her skill 2 while 1.5 on her ultimate. And remember, the duration increases as you add more magic power stats. Now let's discuss the cons of the revamped Aurora. Slightly weaker damage. While the revamped Aurora has gained utility and control, her damage output has taken a hit. She's no longer the one-shot burst mage she used to be. This means you need to rely more on teamwork to secure kills. Short Range Vulnerability Aurora's skills have relatively short casting ranges, which can make her vulnerable to enemies when trying to land her abilities. Positioning is key and getting caught out of position can lead to her demise. In conclusion, the revamped Aurora on the advanced server brings a mix of pros and cons to her gameplay. Her improved cooldowns, 2-1 combo potential, passive outplays, and crowd control capabilities make her a versatile mage on the battlefield. 
However, her slightly weaker damage and short-range abilities can make her challenging to play in specific team compositions. So what are your thoughts on the revamp Aurora? Are you excited to try out her new playstyle? Share your thoughts in the comment section. That's all for this video. Stay safe and thank you for watching.